You look ready for something. Always ready. No, for what? Anything. What about a hurricane? Yeah, hurricane, volcano. I'm trained in all that stuff. Um, that's, that's another course. What, voc volcano prevention? Volcano prevention and volcano survival. You could survive yeah. a volcano? I'm actually, yeah, I'm actually doing some lectures about that at a university. It's basically a lecture about how to prevent a volcano <laughs> in your own home. Say you're sitting in your living room, yeah. right? Exactly. There's not much on the telly. You let your never guard is. down a bit. It never is. You let your guard down a bit. <laughs> well, I never really let my guard no, down. No, what about if it, the average person let their guard down a bit and then, one, and then the next minute there's a volcano? Because imagine you're eating your fish and chips and the volcano erupts. You've got a knife in your hand, you're liable to cut your own throat. Yeah, you could slip and stab yourself to death as opposed to being burnt alive. Exactly. Exactly, see? And a lot of it is state of mind, how you think. You've got to think like a survivor. You're yeah. saying that sometimes positive mental attitude can actually help you survive in a volcano? Do you know wearing a tie can be a very dangerous situation because it's also can be used as a weapon against you. 